Hey guys, this is Thor Odinson doing a uh, Iron Man Iron Man 2 um, comparison video. Here we have the Mark III from the Iron Man 1 series, and this one is the Mark VI from the Iron Man 2 series. You can tell right off rip that um, the paint is extremely different. Like this one is. Uh, really dark <laughs> fucking alright this one's like candy apple red you know there's and this one is more the you know the hot rod red I guess uh, you can see I mean this one this guy's his knees are kinda of bent up a little bit you know and I don't like these joints in here they're really tight but you know they're this one is, uh, the Mark VI is slightly taller. Sorry about the, the video, I'm recording it on my iPhone, I don't have a camera right now. But, okay, so let's get into it. This one, the Mark III, you know, I don't know how everyone else's is, but you can see, you know, the paint is kind of fucked up. I mean, I guess that's... It looks like it's supposed to be like that, but you can see here in his helmet, you see that on his that, you know, and, uh, I mean, I really like these, a lot of people don't like them, you know, because of the shoulder pads and all that shit, but I'm just a diehard Iron Man fan, so, you know, these look really fucking cool to me. Shardimus asked for this video, video comparison, I'm not sure on what exactly he wants, but, uh, yeah, you know, I mean, the the chest is pretty much the same. Chest articulation, the feet articulation. This one has um, a ball, and this one looks more like it's popped in there. You know, this one has the same kind of joint as the, as like the hips and stuff. Uh, they both have double jointed elbows. You know, the only real difference in these figures, besides the paint, is that these fucking shoulder pads are part of the figure. Which is really awesome. So you don't lose them, you know. Lots of people got trouble popping them off and then getting them back on. And the thing is, it's like, they use like three different reds in here. I mean, if you have it, that's the only way you can really see it. But these, I mean, it's like it, it gets pale and then deeper in some points. I mean, if that's supposed to resemble shading, I'd say good job. But if it's just a shitty paint job, then I don't know. But, you know, he only comes with one hand. You know, his wrists are, they're not articulated. I mean, it can go down all the way, but because of this... I guess his his hands can pop out too. Probably not supposed to, but because of the the hand thing, he can't really get that that Iron Man look. You know, I just got him in his uh, you know little fight move. <laughs> Please excuse me. This is my second video ever, but I think I'm doing pretty well. Um. You know, the legs are just a shit ton more detailed. And, you know, I did. I, I agree with Shardimus. He said, you know, they, uh, these figures, Iron Man 1 series, they just really look really fucking puny. Like, it's not really a suit of armor. Like, these legs are really bulky, and they look mechanical. Let me grab the, there's a Mark II. Mark II, you know, He's he's super thin. The legs are the legs are just like sticks. There's no way that that's right. <clears throat> you know. And you know the the paint on the Mark II is really shitty. You know, I mean it's supposed to be dull gray. My joints are really loose on mine. I don't know if that's how your guys's are, but whatever so 
particular, you know, these ones, they come with all these hands. You get all these extra hands. I got a lot more here because I got the Mark IV ones too. But, you know, this one can't really, his head doesn't really move up and down. The Mark III just goes side to side. And with this one, say if you want to do a flying pose, you know, you can. His head moves pretty far back and all the way down, you know. See the back, you know. The back looks pretty similar, you know, except just this. The Mark VI is just a ten times better figure. And I know there's, there's lots of hype about the Iron Man 2 War Machine figure. But, um, I got this War Machine, and this is the, the new series, that's the Iron Man Legends, I guess it's called, it's the newest one, they have like a yellow box, and this is the exact same figure as the Walmart one, so I got this for 17 bucks, and it's got all the right paintings and on, on it and all that, so, yeah. I didn't really want the Iron Man 2 one because I ain't battling with people on eBay to get it. Just so you know, the new ones are the same. But if, the, if I left anything out, uh, you know, comment. I'm still new to this. Store Odinson, signing out.